Hey everybody, Carl here from Afton. In this video, I'm gonna show you how to remove the filter from your GE dishwasher. The model we're using here is the GDP 630, but this is gonna be the same pretty much across the entire GE lineup. First thing you're gonna to wanna to do is open up the door and you're gonna take out the bottom drawer. So it's best to not have any dishes in there just to, just to keep it a little bit lighter. And you're gonna see the filter right here in the middle on the bottom. And you see these two arrows and they're kind of matched up with these other two arrows on the outside. And you're just gonna twist this counterclockwise and you'll be able to lift it up. And you'll see here on the outside, there's this wire mesh filter and that's gonna catch all the particles. It is good to do this probably once a month, depending on how often you're washing your dishes. Uh, but then you have another filter area here. So you'll wanna take out both of these and you're gonna take your filter, you're gonna run it under some hot water in your sink. And if there's stuff that doesn't fall off, take like a soft bristled toothbrush and just sort of go over it a little bit. You don't wanna use anything too abrasive because you can damage the filter. But you're gonna clean all of that stuff off and then when you're done, you're just gonna put the two parts back where they came from. And you're gonna make sure that those arrows line up and you'll feel it kind of, you just have to kind of turn it around back and forth until it locks into place and you turn it clockwise and you'll hear a little click like that. I don't know if you can hear that on the microphone, but that means it's locked back into place and your filter's clean and your water's gonna be flowing through there nicely. It's gonna keep your dishes cleaner that way too. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next one.